Can you guys tell I'm excited for the 4th of July? <laughs> Just a little bit. Hey guys, happy 4th of July. I know when I upload this, it's probably not gonna be 4th of July anymore. Boo, you stink! But today it is, and as you can see, I'm festive as ever. I just love getting festive on holidays. Okay, today is a very special video. So I watched Sarah Vasca, and you guys probably know who that is. She is just hilarious. She's one of my favorite YouTubers ever. She did a reading fan fiction challenge. It was her, Ashlyn, and her sister, and her sister and Ashlyn read a fanfic about her and Harry Styles, and why? Why? People are already getting drunk and driving on July 4th, I'm telling you. It is still light outside. I posted me watching her video on my Snapchat and I was like, can someone please write terrible fanfiction about me, Freddie, and Michael? I hope I pronounced your name right. I think it's Geraldine. Geraldine, please tell me if I'm wrong, but thank you so much for writing this. I'll put the link of this in the description. Oh my gosh! Are you kidding? Alright, just a disclaimer, I have not read this yet. <laughs> chapter 1. First of all, the cover of this chapter is a skeleton in a like inflatable pool thing with drinks. It says, get in loser, we're going to hell. I already love it. Chapter 1. XD! She put the XD face? Oh my god, I did this in my emo phase. Like, what the fuck is about to happen? Okay, RAR. Oh my god. I swear if this takes place when I was emo, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> I went through that emo scene phase, we know this. Hey, this is my first three people fic. Follow for follow, thanks. <laughs> Ashley woke out of bed. Woke out of bed. <laughs> that is not correct. Ashley woke out of bed when her phone rung. Oh, gee, I wonder who it is. <gasps> Hello, said Ashley. Hey, it's Michael. Oh, shit. Oh. Ashley stood there, blushing. She had a crush on Michael Cun for a very long time. Michael Cun. <laughs> my morning, my Michael Cun. <laughs> The blood rushing to her cheeks. This is Ashley. It's in parentheses and it just says this is Ashley and it's an embarrassed face. It's like <laughs> Ashley, I wanted to tell you something. Michael said quietly. What is it? Ashley questioned questionably. <laughs> question questionably. Just come over, please, he muttered. Okay. XD. <laughs> I'm in my emo phase in this fanfic, and that is seriously how I would spell okay. And I would always do the XD phase. Holy shit. Ashley said, B4 hanging up. She dashed to her closet and picked out something smexy. <laughs> These freaking emojis, like, they're not emojis. It's the one that looks like a butt on the side. It's a colon and then a butt. Oh, a colon and a butt. <laughs> she picked out a pair of ripped Nets. So cool and edgy. <laughs> a thriller shirt with Michael's face. That's literally the only thing that's gone right in this fanfic. A short plaid pleated skirt and black high heels. This is seriously what I looked like. How my mom let me go out of the house like this, I don't know. She walked over to the bathroom and did her makeup. Makeup and hairstyle in the pic below. Y'all. This is seriously what I, I look like. Okay. She grabbed her skull purse, shoved in her phone, and left her house. She drove to Michael Cunn's house. Michael Cunn's will always make me laugh. Michael Cunn's house alone because her parents happened to be away for the week. Ooh, so they're alone. <laughs> Seriously, my mom would not even let me be at my house alone until I was like 15. She parked her car and ran up to the gates. Michael, I'm here, Ashley yelled. <sighs> the gates opened and she ran up to the golf cart with Michael in it. Hey, Mikey, cut you. Hey, Ashley Chan, eat your bag. What the Ashley got into the cart, sitting really close to Mikey because the car is very small. As Michael drove around to the actual house, Ashley played what 
her hair. <laughs> she was really nervous because she loved Michael. Her thoughts were put to an end when the car stopped in front of NJ's house. Uh-oh. She climbed out the cart, pulling her skirt down in case naughty little Michael tries to look with this really weird face that looks like an owl. <laughs> Michael unlocked the door and let Ashley in first. He walked in after her and led her upstairs. Holy shit. Ashley was confused. Did I just fucking ask this question? What's upstairs, Michael? What do you think is upstairs? Dumb hoe? Like what? You'll see, winky face. He stopped in front of the door and turned around to face Ashley. Close your eyes, girl. Okay. <laughs> Her eyes were closed. Michael ripped his pants off to reveal another pair in gold. <gasps> no, you didn't. No, you did it! He lied on the bed that was covered in roses. Oh, oh shit, okay. Open your eyes. Ashley opened her eyes and she instantly blushed. Oh! Oh my girl! It smells like oh my girl! Oh my girl! <laughs> then he pinned her against the wall. But Michael, he bit his lip as Ashley got a huge nosebleed. This is some like anime shit happening. What the shit? He crashed his lips onto her, still licking her, holding her, still licking her hands. Ooh. Still holding her hands in place. When they part for air, she looks down to Mike Zilla going up to Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, I'm sorry. You see Spulge, the owl face again. What's this? Am I 12? What the fuck? You wanna find out? Okay, whoa. He lets go of Ashley and unzips his pants and out comes Freddie Mercury! <laughs> Freddie came out of Michael's gold pants. <laughs> Mike Zilla is Freddie Mercury. <laughs> he steps out of the gold plants, pants and slides to Ashley. Oh my geez, Freddie saw it. Freddie was her second crush and he was shirtless in front of her. Things are heating up. Each guy looked at Ashley. They both got down on one knee with two ring pop rings. <laughs> Ashley Chan, will you marry us? Yes, XD, I will marry you guys. She got two ring pops, one for each hand. She licked the candy rings while her two new hubbies watched. OMG, like that blood of the dance floor song, Lollipop. I'm so glad you mentioned blood on the dance floor in this. Oh my god. What happens next? You'll never know because this fanfic was too cringy for me to finish. P.S. I hate blood on the dance floor. Why am I actually sad that there's not a part two? Like, I hope the ring pop ain't the only thing that I licked. Like, I need to know. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this video is probably one of my weirder ones, um, but you know, that's just what this channel's about. I mean, you're talking to the girl that has on 4th of July eyelashes, so. I hope you guys have a great 4th of July. I hope it's lit. If your family's anything like mine, you're probably gonna be the only one that's not drunk. I'm only slightly kidding. Oh! Shout out. I have two because last week I forgot. Today's shout out, we're gonna have Hannah. She is a queen. Not my Hannah, I love you Hannah. But uh, this is another Hannah that I talk to. We talk on Snapchat a lot. She's the best, I freaking love her. And the next shout out is gonna be Amber. She lives in the UK as well. A lot of you guys live in the UK, which is awesome. I've always wanted to go to the UK. Um, but she always tells me I'm saving up money to buy you a ticket here to fly out and meet me Like that's how bad I want to meet you. She's like give me like a year or two and I'll probably have the money I was like girl that is so what? She recently dyed her hair a really like pretty it's it's I think it's like a silverish color It's not like mine. It's more silver, but it is so cute and she's just adorable and I just love you so much girl Thank you Geraldine. I hope I say your name right. Thank you so much for the fanfic. I seriously love Love it. Honestly, Loki want a part two, but I'm not gonna put you through that stress and pain. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Bye!